talking about poultry and the Greater Accra Poultry Farmers Association is encouraging the consumption of locally produced chicken to create a sustainable and commercially competitive poultry industry here in Ghana. As the festive season approaches, the association contends the attitudinal change of Ghanaians for local chicken will be a game changer for the industry. Available statistics show that poultry farmers in Ghana have since 2014 imported more than 5 million day old chicks every year to meet their shortfall in local production. Existing hatcheries in the country have been underperforming, producing between 20 to 40 percent of installed capacity. However, the Greater Accra Poultry Farmers Association revealed that it is in constant engagement with the Kwame Nkrumah University of Science and Technology to ensure they provide modernized hatcheries for local producers. Figures from the Ghana National Association of Poultry Farmers reveal over 135,000 metric tons of frozen chicken was imported from the European zone to Ghana in 2017. The figure represents a 76% increase over 2016 imports. The 2017 frozen chicken import constituted about 112 million beds. The Greater Accra Poultry Farmers Association wants government to provide a roadmap on how to curb the importation of poultry in order to compel the consumption of locally produced chicken. The importation doesn't employ people. It employs people in the other countries. It's just the end, the end product, which is the best that come. That's what we're, we're, we sell. So if we do that, we will create a lot of employment for the country and, and the, the level of employment will come down. The association contends local producers can only thrive if the general public change their taste for foreign chicken to keep them in business. As we go into December, we are encouraging every Ghanaian who eats chicken or eats eggs. Uh, so we encourage everybody to eat. And you know, white, white meat is healthy. So, so let's engage ourselves with chicken. And uh, as we bite on it, let's remember the, the farmers who produced it and then speak for them. Okay. Meanwhile, the association's performance in the year 2018 revealed strong resilience in the midst of a very difficult operational environment. Prices of major raw materials, including maize and soya bean meal, reached record high levels. The Executive Council has begun the process of relocating the association's production operations to Gomwa Akochi.